is, okay, with Netflix cracking down on password sharing in March and introducing ads with the basic package, will you be keeping your Netflix subscription? Or are you going to look elsewhere? Does anybody watch it? Yes. <laughs> Who watches it? Currently, I am. This morning. Almost every day. <laughs> so I'm going to pay for it. It'll be at my house then. Mm. So then you. Yeah. It's going to be like, it's not like a whole other account, right? But isn't it, they'll yeah. charge you extra based on like how many locations is that? Yeah. Like, what, they're what they're going to do is, what they're going to do is, they want you to like log in. It, it's got to be connected to the wi the main Wi Fi of whoever is the account holder. Every 31 days, you got to watch something on there. And then, like, for other devices and stuff, like, you have to be connected to, like, that Wi-Fi. Like, they're going to crack down on different... They're going to monitor closely what devices get logged into each account. And if you want to go somewhere... And the location. I was going to say... Yeah, if you want to go somewhere, you got to get a temporary code. So, let's say you're watching Netflix on the plane or in a hotel. It's a temporary code, and that's only good this for... This isn't going to last. It's only good for seven. You do? Mm -hmm. no. I think they're all going to start seven. cracking down more and more on password well, sharing. Because there's like... groups like, oh, you get HBO Max, we get Netflix, which is what we all do. That's not what we do. Yeah. Well, but it's not but you, people but... do it. Yeah. Yeah. He pays for Netflix. I pay for Disney. <laughs> it's smart. I pay for HBO. <laughs> you pay Max. for HBO. We I pay for be, YouTube we probably TV. Shouldn't be so... saying this, huh? I don't care. Listen, I don't. I can't imagine that they're gonna they're gonna lose subscribers. That's all there is to it. I think they might lose subscribers, yeah. but I think they'll still make more money. They'll use like a yeah. ton of viewers, like instantly right off the get go. Like from a business perspective, yeah, I, I don't know like what percentage of views are like the password sharing per thing. But say, say out of like a million accounts, see the the numbers, but articulate that right. But you know what I mean? Like say, yeah. Yeah. say seventy five percent of people that are on password sharing don't watch it anymore and 25 percent do start paying on their own that's kind of a no-brainer yeah yeah the whole on the go thing that's what mm. makes all and it's only good apps. for seven days like seven consecutive days so if you're on the road for like two weeks i guess i don't know what you do then they said you can't put in a request to change your primary um wi-fi network or something like that and that becomes your permanent one but well the people think it's gonna last forever yeah. Did, did, did people think no. it was gonna last forever? Well, yeah. I just don't. I don't. Yeah. I don't really particularly like Netflix. I think it's. Yeah. it's my least so, there are. I don't use it. I use it the least. Only thing. Only reason why we have it is because there are some blockbusters on there, like Stranger Things, and um, There's a ton of content. Yeah, uh, Squid Game was it's huge. Not, a lot of the original like shows. I think all of the Netflix originals so mid. And it's like the stuff in the last. And I loved, I loved Clover Kai, but yeah, he, yeah, he's right. I mean, it's not a lot, but what they, there is some stuff on there that's like okay, yeah, if you would have watched that. There and there's some documentaries that I like too, but it's probably I don't Maybe the it's one my I, demographic then because I watch a ton on Netflix. Yeah. Right, I don't know. See, we we pay for our own Netflix, so we what? don't. We're not worried about it. But Judging me, silently. I know you. I think it will. I think it will lose subscribers, but it'll probably still make money. Oh no, we'll see. We'll so see. lose subscribers. You think, you think people that are paying will stop paying because they can't share it? Well, yeah, yeah if I, they're don't I think the freeloaders. No, I, I, I think I think the freeloaders <laughs> will kind of get cut off, and a small mm. minority of them will start paying. I'm not sure if subscriber count will really go down. You think it will? Yeah, maybe not. I think it will because there are because a lot of people do that trade thing where I pay like we do like I pay for Netflix and you pay for this and then it's like I get your password of it because like I and think, you think out of that three let's say like three families you're right with that mm -hmm. system that if one family out of say three groups has Netflix and they crack down on password sharing that none of the three of them would still have a Netflix account. They, I think someone's going to pay. They those. might. I, more than one I mean, they those. might, or there are some people who say it might not be worth it. I don't know. It, it, it's going to be interesting to see. Like, I think a lot of people that share their passwords, though, they don't necessarily do it for free. They get something out of it. There's some like kind a of trade, right? There's a trade well, system, trade, or yeah. maybe they are getting a portion of the subscription for it. Like, it's not necessarily like, like I don't just loan out my account. Like, like, if a friend was coming, like, hey, let me get this real quick. I'm like, no, dude. Like, I'm going to need something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. But 
I, I, but then again, those people that are paying, maybe they could just get their own Netflix account. I think it just depends. Honestly, it depends on the content and the person who they are. If they enjoy the content or if they don't enjoy the content. If they think it's worth it, they don't think it's worth it. Um, I mean, I, I just think Netflix has a huge library of stuff. Most of it is not that great, but they do have some things on there, though, that mm. are worthy of, you know, but but then again, like, you could be like like me, where I'm stuck, all my favorite shows, I'm in between seasons. I could probably cancel it right now and wait until all those, all those, you know, renew and then get it back, watch everything and cancel it again. I can see that happening, too. Yeah. But, I'm not surprised, and I think it kind of makes sense. Yeah. I'm not, sure, I'm not sure what else people expected. The on the go thing, though, like, that's the whole, like, benefit of streaming. Yeah. Like, I can take my whole was... iPad and go wherever with all my apps. Well, I think you can, but uh, it's, it's yeah. probably, like you said, like, it has to kind of be connected to the home place yeah. once in a while. Yeah, it says every 31 days, you have to be connected to the primary uh, Wi Fi and you have to watch something. See, because I think they have to make sure, yeah. like, that it's not. And they can meet people that are already there and actually pay for it. Yeah, so they would never notice the difference. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I get it. It's so. I. It's funny though because then was, they don't care one bit. Yeah. No. Just as recent as like 2017, I guess that's really not that recent. But uh, they were like encouraging people to password share. Like they had a whole like thing on Twitter. They're like, yeah, share your password. Like they were encouraging it back then. I guess times have changed now. Viewership, yeah. <laughs> Viewership, yeah. All that there wasn't as much competition back then either. No. Netflix was like the only one for quite a while. I mean, yeah, since then, HBO Max. <laughs> yeah, Peacock. Uh, Disney Plus wasn't even around then. No, Paramount Plus. Mm-hmm. And um, a lot more competition needs to be. Oh, yeah. Now, now I was like, man, can we just go back to cable now? It's the same crap. You used to <laughs> have to pay for eight stations to get the one you want. Now you got to pay, pay for, for a service to get the one show you like. Eight different streaming. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's that that it's never easy. It's always like I don't know. It'd be nice to have everything in just one spot, pay the one subscription, but then that then you end up paying like a hundred bucks. It, it, it I don't know. It comes out to be the same, but um I don't know. We'll probably keep our Netflix because we have all the other streaming services anyway. So what it doesn't really hurt us anyways. Yeah. But I can see why people would cancel because. I mean, like I said, like if you're in between all your favorite shows on it and you don't watch it, why keep it? But how would that change from people I mean, with the Patrick sharing? I think there's a lot of people. I think there's now? a lot of people that are in that boat. They're like, oh, I better not cancel this because somebody else is using my stuff, and they're probably watching it, so I'll keep it for them. There's probably a lot of that, like that, that, that's yeah. going on. But I don't know. Yeah. I'm not speaking for everybody. I'm just that's my own. Analysis. That's a, yeah. I, I'm, I'm not cancel for that. Yeah, right. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I, guess, I don't know what mom would do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know if she watches it still. So. Yeah. It, it, yeah, and it's if you're a sports fan, streaming is not even. It's way harder. Do you ever come across a, <laughs> oh expensive like Karen and I on the, on the treadmill? Like I'll. It, she just turns it off. So like I turn the TV on again. It's like on on her profile or yeah. stuff. And I back out of stuff. Yeah. It's like looking through someone else's feed on something. Like, how do people enjoy this? Yeah, I know. It's all this <laughs> stuff like here's Notting Hill and like 85 Hallmark movies and oh, geez. Ride, geez. ride for Rally. And the mom's just drama stuff. <laughs> I'm just like, what are you doing on here? And it's re-watching the same stuff too. And I'm just like, something new? Come on. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I guess for now I'm keeping my Netflix. I don't... You can probably keep it. I'm not worried about the ads part though because we don't pay for the basic... But you guys keep it or get, get, rid, of get rid of it? Rid of it. Get rid of it. You cancel Netflix, I'm gonna kick you out of YouTube TV. I know your password. <laughs> I'll change the password. Well, that's settled. <laughs> 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 Don't what? cancel Netflix. 